welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to a breaking news of Jerusalem's Gate. We have breaking news. Sound the alarm. <laughs> uh, if I had an alarm, I would sound it. Uh, now, this is coming out of the Times of Israel. Syria accuses Israel of striking military sites south of Damascus. So Israel struck, uh, reportedly, uh, right outside of Damascus. And, uh, you know, uh, Netanyahu will not put up with any uh, Iranian uh, incursions into Syria, just too close to the border. It just Syria borders Israel, and it's, you have to understand that uh, the forces that are supplying these, uh, majority of the terrorists in that region are supplied a lot by Iran. And I'm sure that $1.8 billion in cash, a lot of that went to uh, terrorists, I'm sure, or in, in somebody's pocket. Uh, let's uh, read a little of the article. Air raid uh, comes hours after IDF reports, quote, abnormal activities by Iranian forces in Syria. Explosion rocks al Kishwa region, an area said to contain an Iranian base. And we got a video here of it, too. Syrian state media reported on Tuesday night that Israel conducted an airstrike south of Damascus in the area previously identified as the site of a suspected Iranian military base. Uh, Syria's official Santa News outlet said that the country's air defense intercepted two Israeli missiles over the El uh, Kishwa uh, area south of Damascus. The report did not specify how many missiles were fired. So, ladies and gentlemen, we have prophecy being fulfilled right before our very eyes. Uh, you know, I, I've, I've talked about uh, what the scriptures say about, uh, uh, you know, Damascus until I'm blue in the face. Uh, you know, Damascus will be a ruinous heap, the prophets, the old prophets tell us. Uh, let's take a look at this video. I'm going to try to blow it up for you. It's kind of a, uh, let's see here, let's see if we can get it going. Well, it's not blowing up. It's not, uh, there it is. Israel struck back, ladies and gentlemen. Israel struck. And, uh, you know, I, I foresee Iran and Israel having it all out, an all-out war together uh, against one another. I uh, truly believe that. I think uh, Iran has uh, said that they're going to try to destroy Israel one too many times. And I think Netanyahu and the people of Israel are getting sick and tired of their life being threatened by the Iranian regime, and I call it regime like our pre uh, commander in chief calls it a regime. It is a regime. Uh, it's been hijacked for many years now, and the citizens are uh, the ones that are uh, caught in a uh, you know that suffers from this. From the because if they uh, would you know conduct business regularly and not supply and arm and have anything to do with terrorists or uh, anything like that, they uh, wouldn't have these sanctions on them, but uh, they are a terrorist nation and they support terrorists. And uh, I'm sorry if you're an Iranian and you don't agree with me. Uh, you know that's everybody doesn't agree with everybody. But once again, it, Israel struck uh, a uh, Iranian military base in south of Damascus. So as we see this uh, war getting closer and closer and more and more into Damascus. Uh, just think what I've been uh, just think about what I've been preaching for such a long time about uh, Damascus being a ruinous heap uh, But with that being said I wanted to give you this breaking news. I pray you all are doing well uh, I'm, If you haven't uh, seen the video of uh, President Trump uh, His announcement 
Uh, I highly recommend you, uh, if, if you don't know what uh, happened today, to view that past uh, video. Uh, thanks a lot. I know I said it in one of my last videos. Thanks a lot, new subscribers. I'm very humbled and blessed to have you as a subscriber, and we'll try to do a very good job for you. And if you would like to help out Jerusalem's Gate, hey, we don't accept money. We're just a small little uh, Christian network. Uh, but uh, your like, comment, and subscribe will go a long way with us. With that in said, you're watching and listening to another broadcast of Jerusalem Gate. God bless you all. May God protect you and yours. And uh, we love you, and thank you very much for watching.